All right, now that Colt's explained why we want to use a more traditional object-oriented class-based setup, let's go ahead and do that. Now we'll be using a piece of code by John Resig that fakes class-based object-oriented programming. Feel free to take a look at the code or the linked blog below to see how it works. Now, we're not terribly interested in the internals for our purposes. What we care about is how to use it for instantiating the proper class-based inheritance trees for our game objects. So let's say we want to create the following inheritance tree. We want weapon and entity to both inherit from class, and we want machine gun and chain gun to inherit from weapon, and teleport and energy canister to inherit from entity. Now we've started this off for you, but we're gonna have you complete this yourself. First, we set weapon to be class.extend. What this means is that weapon extends all of class's functionality, whatever that happens to be, and then adds its own on top of it. Similarly, machine gun is set to weapon.extend, which extends all of weapon's functionality and then builds on top of that. Now we've created these for you for a template, and what I'd like you to do is fill in the rest of the inheritance tree we discussed above. 